let me give a try it was in the late 80s when people were migrating from their native to cities for jobs. Anthony was one of them who went in search of job. Anthony was a young boy who went along with his maternal uncle for sofa making and repairing. The sofa repairing job the job seekers needed to go along with his tools either by bicycle or by walk through every street of the particular town. Anthony knew nothing of it initially but his uncle took him along for work. His uncle knew sofa repairing. Anthony observed his uncle very closely while working. As the days went by his uncle himself couldn't find job. So he asked Anthony to go in different directions for finding job. Anthony was very nervous to go alone for job. After a long hours of riding the bicycle he couldn't get any job on the first day. It was in the evening that he got his first job and he made it. After finishing the job he got his first salary. He felt so happy and the feel was like finding water in the desert and drinking it. Slowly he learned the nuances of sofa making and repairing. One day as he was riding the bicycle near a lake he found his friends who were also migrated like him. They were also in same line of searching job. Anthony learned that his friends gather near a lake either at the end of the day or if they couldn't get the job. They gather near the lake and share their experiences. On the next day Anthony didn't get the job so he came to the lake in the afternoon. There he found his friends discussing very seriously about something. After stopping the bicycle Anthony asked his friends about the discussion. Then they said that two of his friends received a job but they neglected it because it was a new kind of sofa which they had never seen before. So they said no to the one who offered them the job. Now Anthony was very curious about it. So he asked his friends to take him there. They all said no because they were frightened and if anything went wrong they would ask him to pay for it. Even then Anthony asked them to take him there so that at least he could have a look at it. His friends took him and left near the gate of that company and ran back to the lake. Anthony entered the company and inquired for the repairing work. They show him the sofa. Yes, it was really a new kind of sofa. Anthony was well versed in calculating the expenses of a job very fast without using any calculator. He said the exact amount to the owner before starting the work. Anthony already learnt that for any kind of sofa the magic resided behind it. So he opened the back part of the sofa and understood the structure and he started repairing it. Meanwhile Anthony's uncle also joined Anthony's friends. Now and then they all used to come to the company's vicinity and were curiously watching whether Antony was thrown out or not. It was around 4 hours they couldn't find Antony. Then Antony came out of the company happily with the salary. They ran to him asked whether he was beaten up or they asked him to pay for the damage. Antony boldly said that he had completed the work successfully. He asked them to check if they had any doubts. They all together went to the company again and saw the sofa. The sofa looked like a new one. To his uncle's surprise he made it. Then all came out of the company and celebrated it. From that day onward Antony became done for them. For any kind of difficult job they approached him to solve it. Life gives a chance once to everyone to change the pattern of life by solving its puzzle. Catch hold of it and solve it then the beautiful life is yours. Let me give a try.